Woke Pill 101, you already know, man. Today, what we are going to be talking about, we're going to be talking about how to get over her, my guy. Getting over female, man. This video is for people that are new, man. That have no idea what the red pill is and have never really experienced the truth before. And let me tell you right now, man. To get over a female, you have to realize that there's millions out there, man. No, fuck that. I'm, 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 have, to, <laughs> I'm gonna have to censor that, but you have to realize there's trillions of women out there, my guy. Trillions, look it up. There are trillions of women. And out of those trillions, a good portion speak English or Spanish. You just have to realize not one girl is special. And realizing this and just knowing this and believing in it will make you more of a higher value male than you would ever think. The reason why is that you won't be afraid to lose a female. And once you have that, that leads to you being more attractive and more assertive. Because females love a dominant guy. They like a guy that does his thing and a guy that doesn't care about them. Trust me, my guy. The less you care, the more she's want to give. The less you give, the more she wants to give to you, my guy. Look, I give these girls nothing. I make fun of them. But they chasing me. Why are they chasing me? Hasn't society told us to always be the nice guy? To always give them gifts? To always shower them with compliments? But in return... We get cheated on. We get crapped on. We get made fun of. We get taken advantage of. We not show true appreciation. But the asshole over there, who's not validating them, being a bad boy, is getting all their attention. Isn't that crazy? And there's a reason on why I truly believe this. It's because of that right there. I went from a nice guy that always and always and always get played day after day with a female with a female with a different one, bro. And I've changed to the ultimate bad boy alpha, man. That just doesn't care, man. And pulls holes. And has them chase. It just baffles me that nice guys will continue to think being a nice guy is always going to work out. No, it is never going to work out for you. And sure, man. Look here. Nice guys? Yeah, they will marry. And for me, preferably, I don't think they will win. Ever. But there's some nice guys that will win in the end. When they get the girl of their dreams. The girl that they always wanted in high school. In his 20s, man. She was all over the place. She was rocking it, kicking it, doing all these sorts of guys. And the nice guy was always try to be her best friend first. And then smash. That was always a side thing. But he's always going to treat it. I'm going to be your friend first. I'm going to be the good guy. You're going to love me. No, no, no. Not until she's 30 and she has a kid. She's going to look at you. She's going to see, oh, you got a stable job. She's going to hit you up and call you for, no, for you to be her beta male provider. That's how it is. If you ever get rejected, and if you ever get broken up with, the best way to get over that is just not to care. I mean, it sucks, but right now, we're in a world where there's trillions of people out there, millions of people, and having this mindset ingrained in your head will help so much more. Of course, I can tell you guys to play games. Also, work on your purpose, because working on your purpose can make you forget about things, man. I'm not even tripping. It gets you focused on what you want to do with your life. It motivates you to prove everyone wrong, my guy. That's a big motivating factor. To grind on what you want to do and fulfill in your life. That's the best thing you can do right now. That's the best way to get over any female, my guy. The best way. Another thing you could do. Try playing games, my guy. That's what I did. Get in a lobby with the homies, play some Black Ops. But I highly, highly prefer you guys be on your purpose. 
honest to God and having the mindset that there's millions out there. Millions of girls, man. Like, don't even cap it to me. Just don't even cap. I just find it funny that in society, we're always told... I say this before, I'm always going to say it. You, you have to be the nice guy. And if you guys are new to Red Pill, man, with Red Pill, it says that that doesn't work. It tells men. Red Pill is a philosophy, my guy. It tells us that what society tells us to be and to do is completely wrong. That doesn't attract a female. That doesn't want her to chase us. Because as guys, we want girls to chase us. That's our genetic makeup. We want them to chase us. We want we want to be the alphas. We want to be the man. But to be the man, we've been dumbed down by society. We've been dumbed down to believe we have to get blue collar jobs. We've been dumbed down to believe we have to follow what feminism has to say. Which feminism ruins a man. I'm talking about modern day feminism, my guy. Completely, completely, completely flips the table on how screwed guys are. Because before feminism, man, things were Gucci. And feminism, bro, talk about modern day feminism, my guy. It just kills the family household in so many different ways. But other than that, the best way to get over a female is to realize. That she's missing out. And to make her realize that. Is to improve yourself every day. Get in the gym. Start working out. Get in shape. Start messing with these other girls my guy. There's options out here. There's so many options. They're like cards my guy. Cards in a deck. You flip them like it's nothing. But with these cards. Ain't none of them special. Just flip them around. Oh, that one looks nice. You got four spades? Oh, look, a joker? Let me just... Uh, the king? Uh, queen? Uh. Cards, my guy. Well, last thing I have to say is just enjoy yourself and enjoy your life, man. Because you only have one. And you're going to spend that time crying and worrying about her? Nah, bro. In this channel, we out here screwing hoes. We're out here getting these daddies. We are out here being chased by women. If you guys take my advice to heart, you listen to everything I have to say, y'all will be way, way better than the average man. Way above the average man. Because in the average man in society, in 2020, you get screwed over so badly. Back then, the average guy... Could still pull some girls. But in today's society where the internet is prevalent. And social media is prevalent. And social status is prevalent. The average guy. With an average following. I don't know. 100 followers. 1000 followers. Don't mean nothing. He don't mean nothing. He's nothing. And it sucks to say that. But a girl won't look his way. You gotta be good at least in your body looks. Be really really good. In your business. Or just be really, really good with your charisma. But having all these three things, being good in three of these, bro, yo, you're the top 1%. You're the top percent, my guy. Work towards that. Because it's possible. Any man can get up to that. Jix takes work and grind, my guy. You gotta grind. When you grind on something, work on it every single day. It doesn't come in a month or two or three. Junk takes years. I'm going to give you guys the facts. It takes years. I'm not going to dub it down and say, you know, it takes months. Of course it takes months. It also takes years, my guy. That's grind. Are you ready to grind? Are you ready to be the top percent, man? All of us should be working to improve ourselves every day. Even if we don't become the top percentage of men, which is really difficult. Be well off. Where you don't have to worry about money. Money ain't a problem. You got yourself sustained. With food. Clothing. With your body. 
and health. If you have that sustain and money to spend, you're good. You got a good body too, bro. You got girls. And a good social following, you're good. I mean, social following, let me restart that. <laughs> you don't got to have a fo- social following. Yeah. But the options will open up once you have a good social following. It's messed up you have to say that, but if you have a good social following, it opens up the doors to different possibilities. Anyway, man, I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Subscribe. I upload every single day. Every single day. No break whatsoever. Even on the holidays. 24-7. Grind nonstop. Anyway, man, I hope y'all have a safe one. I'll see y'all. Peace. Yeah, and while she rock me, ooh, and while she rock me, times fade, go back, and she talk me. Times fade, I will lay, times to go, but I tell